Hey everyone, and welcome back to a brand new Globe Penguin 3D video. So I was just here having a good time eating some pizza with uh, the pals, and um, yeah, so welcome back. Uh, we have here some stuff to check out around the island. There's some new updates, so I'll be showing off them today. But first off, as per usual, uh, we are here on front of the pet shop and uh, we have the last puffle to adopt. Uh, I can't remember the color of the last puffle that we need, but still. So last episode, I told you to leave a comment telling me what name I should call my next puffle and the person who got the most likes was... Speedy Blue 7! So congratulations to you Speedy! Uh, I guess I will call it uh, Tiger Junior, so yeah, I like that name. <laughs> that's a pretty cool one. This time the puffles appear, that's good. And here we have the blue puffle for 400 coins. And as you can see I have 2084 coins, I've been playing a little bit. So yeah, let's stop the blue puffle and uh, let's call it Tiger. Junior, all right, and uh, it's blue just like my penguin, so it matches it makes sense So yeah, thank you so much Speedy for your suggestion and uh, yeah, let's click finish and oh only letters or numbers may be used All right, so we cannot put like a little dot in there. All right, so Tiger Junior. I think uh, this uh, Works over here. Let's see and yep. There it is your new puffle is now in your igloo. Thank you very much all right, so let's now go to my igloo and uh, here it is, Tiger Junior, looking beautiful, oh my goodness. So uh, now I have the three puffles in my igloo, I have the red one, which is called Apple, and funnily enough, the first pin on Club Penguin 3D is an apple, so that is pretty cool. Uh, I have here also Emerald, so Emerald is over here, I love it. And finally, Tiger Junior, our most recent puffle. All right, so let's uh, walk with it for this episode. All right, here it is. While we are here on my igloo, I wanted to show you the secrets for the brand new Better Igloo September 2019 furniture catalog. And uh, as you can see, there's a lot of cream soda on the front page and there's a penguin hidden behind all of them. So that is pretty interesting. All right, so as you can see, we have uh, here a lot of pirate themed items. For what we can see, we have some cream soda, treasure chests, all sorts of cool stuff. So let's try to find some secrets. So I believe the first one is right here. So if you click on the lock of the treasure chest, you unlock the wall shark board for 410 coins. Really awesome. I think there's another one right here on the light of the lifeboat. So if you click on that, you get the short spotlight for 200 coins. All right, I don't think there's any more secrets on this page, but I might be wrong. So let's go to the next page. So we have here the waves. I don't think there's any secrets in there. Uh, and next, that's pretty cool. And over here, if you click on the eyes, quote unquote, it doesn't even have any eyes. But if you click over here, you unlock the microphone for 200 coins. Pretty cool. We have here the edibles. So we have here birthday cake and oh, we have here a secret on the left candle. So if you click on this, you get the coffee table for 250 coins. All right, we have here some more stuff. Oh, and over here on the O berries, if you click here, you unlock the whiteboard for 400 coins. Really cool. And uh, this reminds me of the colors of the beta cat. <laughs> I'm so sad I don't have it. Oh my goodness. I'm I was like five months late for the beta party But still all right, um, so I believe those are all the secrets for this month's uh, furniture catalog uh, If I missed any, please let me know in the comments, but uh, there is an update So if we buy here an item, let's see. I think there's like um, Some items that can change. So let's quickly buy. Let's see. Maybe the cake as our first item so let's see there it is would you like to buy birthday cake for 100 coins of course i want to buy the cake it's delicious all right so birthday cake has been added to your inventory thank you very much and let's also buy some more stuff let's see uh, i believe we can buy the welcome mat yep 75 coins it's uh, it's fairly cheap all right, so what more should we buy? I have no idea. I don't have that many coins. I have quite a few, but uh, 
let's uh, be smart about our money. Uh, so we have here the teddy bear. I want the teddy bear, of course. That's so cute over there. All right. What more should we buy? Let's see. Um, maybe a beach ball. Why not? Pretty cool. All right. Um, let's see. We have here TVs, but they are so expensive. I don't even have enough to buy <laughs> a TV. Maybe this one over here, the HD TV. But uh, I don't know. All right, we have here the dinner table as well. So yeah, let's buy the dinner table. Uh, 700 coins. All right, we can put on the middle of our igloo. And uh, let's buy a chair because we need to sit down somewhere. All right, maybe two if we have a guest. All right, so <laughs> I end up with uh, uh, 199 coins. All right, but it was worth it. So let's take a look at our stuff. We have here all of these pretty cool items. So, uh, let's put the welcome mat over here. Can we like um, uh, change directions of this? Maybe here? Yes, if you click on the arrows, you can change the direction of the item. Alright, so there it is. It's... Uh, wait, I think I, I need to put it uh, over this way. Alright, so it's facing the entrance of the eagle. Yep, there it is. So, um, as I told you, we can change uh, some things here with the furniture. So, if we click here on the arrows, we can put some plates uh, and forks and all of that stuff on top of the table. And the mullet, take a look at this. Alright, it's looking amazing, oh my god. Alright, so I believe they uh, implemented this feature very recently. And uh, might as well put our little bear on top of like the chair. If I, we can do that, let's see. Can you go? Over here? No, I think we cannot put uh, stuff on top of other objects. Uh, at least not this bear. You can now change uh, the appearance of some furniture items. So that is pretty cool. And finally I have some items. Some decorations on my igloo. I think it's looking a lot better than before. So yeah, looking good. Alright Mr. Teddy Bear, you will keep an eye on my igloo. And don't let anybody enter it. Alright? Alright. <laughs> But now I want to show you some stuff that is on the town. So over here you can see that we have some construction going on. So we cannot go to the to the lake. It's like uh, there's like an invisible wall. Uh, I don't know what's happening there. If we go to the map and we click on the lake, there's this like the error 213 room is locked. So I don't know what's the deal with that. Maybe they are changing it. Are doing some construction work over there so once that room is updated or something new happens I will sh of course show it to you and uh, the last thing that I wanted to show you on this episode is over here on the lighthouse as you can see over here we have the migrator yep Rockopper is coming to visit the island and I believe this is the very first time that Rockopper is visiting so that will be a very special moment I cannot wait for Rockper to arrive maybe he will also bring us some rare items and stuff like that that will be pretty awesome and uh, yeah if we go inside the large house uh, I believe we still have the penguin band performing over here yep <laughs> all right that's pretty cool but if we go to the top of the lighthouse so as you can see from the top of the lighthouse we can have a better look of the ship and uh, unfortunately we cannot take a look at the telescope but uh, take a look at the, the attention of the detail over here we can actually see the little migrator through the telescope so that is pretty cool so oh my goodness my puffle fell down so I guess we'll end off the episode right here. I'll take my puffle to the hospital. Uh, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode here on Club Penguin 3D. There's quite a lot of cool stuff. So check it out if you want. The link will be in the description. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. It is very much appreciated. Share it with other people so they can also discover this awesome game. And last but not least, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on future uploads. So yeah, with that being said, I will catch you all in the next one everybody. Bye!